TYT Sports, Denise Jones, Robert Ehrlich, Robert, Robert Latow. I was you didn't even Robert, give me a you called, moment. You called him I thought you were gonna do the I think you're switching. I said Robert. For, oh, you man. said Robert Urich. Hey, I listen, even, because I was obviously trying thinking to... about Robert's 80s on your character mind, actor no. Robert Urich. <laughs> Let me tell you why I messed this up. And minds right Let me now. tell you why I messed this up. Off camera, we were talking about what our initials make. <laughs> and the whole time, I discredited Brett's B in his name mm. and just completely used the E in Ehrlich. So, so focus on the Ehrlich part, man. I have an older brother, so in high school I was always Little E, so that's Little fine. E? Little E? So you knew that, you could feel it. Little, Little e. e, what were you? Little Robert. Little Robert. <laughs> Little Robert. Little Rob. Bobby is what my mom called. I was just Denise. Mm -hmm. I was just Denise. Yeah. But, <laughs> you know what's not just one word is, uh, there are actually three letters. You get the TYT <laughs> app right now um, on the App Store, so it's tyt.com slash app. It's for free, free 99. You can watch a lot of amazing content on there. Um, so yeah, if you have an iPhone, like I do, is everyone an iPhone? Yes, I do. Yes, yes. we do. And if I see an Android, I squish it. Wow. wow. I drop it off a building just Me? to make I'm sure. I'm with you. There you go. Look so yeah, tyt.com <laughs> backslash app to get that app. Uh, moving on, Trey Young made his pitch uh, to go uh, after his Chicago Bulls workout. So it was an exclusive workout. Uh, and he said, I think everybody has things people want to look at and things like that, and I think that there's an area of concern for people, Young said of his size. My job is to go out there and prove that it's not. I mean, that was a concern for people coming into college, and I didn't let that be a factor. That's fair. He goes on to say, uh, I don't think that there's really a way to improve defensively going one on one on <laughs> zero in these workouts. Work on my body, continue to work on my speed, and just show from day one that I'm gonna change the narrative. That's my goal and my job, to change the narrative on that. It's a really mature answer. Like, like, this guy has had a lot of really good PR training, and I completely respect that. He said it in the best way. He wasn't, like, douchey about it. He wasn't overly arrogant. He, he also didn't, uh, like, undersell himself or anything. He said it in the best way, and now a lot of people— Oh, uh, by the way, a lot of people think that he's going to, to the Bulls, but also because he says he has a lot of friends there, he likes the way that they play, he has a history with the team, and he really admires the players. Um, so, what do you guys think? I mean, there's a lot of small guards in the NBA who do just fine. And that's not going to exclusively count him out. Of course, he's going up against that. And if he was taller, people would appreciate it. And I'm, but, He's a but pretty what, tall guy, he's though. Six, it's, he's six foot something. And, uh, and he he's doing what he can. Like, what in this situation, what else is he supposed to do right. other than answer questions like, well, I can't get any taller, so I'm going to get better at basketball. You should thank um, He's 6'2", to be exact. You should, you should thank Steph Curry. Because five, six years ago, he would have been a late first rounder, maybe second round, just because of his size. Right. Even though he can, you know, shoot. But now everybody's scared that they're going to miss out on the next Steph Curry. Exactly. And hey, they still switch Steph Curry on every switch. LeBron was on him a lot in the finals, and he did fine. It's it's about it's, defense. In my mind, is about are you a willing defender, right? And if you have a good team around you to kind of you know help you out. So I think that's going to help him. Is that he said, hey, I'm willing to work on it, and hey. You don't want to miss out on the next Steph Curry. <laughs> right. You really uh, don't. But Steph Curry has an unstoppable shot, Ooh. plus a like paradigm-shifting way of handling the ball Ooh. that is based on, a, on his defender's balance in the margins of a microsecond. Right. You know, right. people that have paradigm shifts are like, Steph Curry and Chris Paul have made like specific changes to the ways you have to play defense. Right. And and yeah, next to you, Trey. So now this is not you gotta come up with something like that. This You're not, not a Trey fan. I'm fine. I'm not. A, I'm not not a Trey yeah, fan. It's just yeah, like I'm so, looking yeah. at a lot of other options when it comes to the NBA draft, and that's that. So he's not even in your top three, top five pick. I think he's top ten. Top ten? Yeah. Yes, I think that's where he's going to fall in the top ten. Look, all I'm, I'm saying, not saying that he'll be Steph Curry. I'm saying that illusion that he could be is what may help him. Yeah. And, it, and it's safe to say because Steph is 6'3", so why not? If he's 6'2", and he's willing to improve defensively, we Steph is an amazing offensive player, and he's shown that many times. But he has also shown that he has bad games, and sometimes he doesn't want to put his heart in there, or maybe he's tired. Like, he's not the perfect player all the time. And Trey Young seems to have the heart and passion, so I feel like you might be wrong. Got it. Jerry yeah, Curl, too. Before. Might be wrong on this one. But you guys let us know what you think in the comments below. And mm -hmm. while you're at it, make sure to like and subscribe to TYT Sports. Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much it, right? Nice Jerry it, right? Curl. <laughs> Comment on that Jerry Curl Trey got.